On March 20th, 2015, the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers Charleston District hosted their inaugural Wounded Warriors Project Fishing Tournament with Wounded Warriors from around the Low Country. Approximately 20 Wounded Warriors attended the event, which was held at the district's St. Stephen Powerhouse. The Wounded Warriors spent the morning fishing in the Tail Race Canal for American Shad, Blueback Herring, and Catfish, and were rewarded with lots of success. But the day wasn't about fishing. It was about providing an activity for our nation's heroes. Reconnected with, with a couple of friends. We made a lot of new ones, and uh, you know, of course, been great to us. And keeps us close out here. We're catching fish, or we're not catching fish. We're still having fun. So you can be around guys and gals that understand. You don't have to explain. You know, something happens, you start to get the shakes. You, you know, start to kind of we call a wig out. You don't have to explain anything. Everything. You can recognize somebody else's symptoms, and they can recognize yours, and kind of you know, lend a hand and. It's okay. Enjoy your the day was also an opportunity for STEM outreach with Charleston's Ashley Hall School. Junior girls came out to aid the wounded warriors as well as learn about fish biology from the South Carolina Department of Natural Resources. The girls were put in charge of measuring and sexing the fish that were caught as well as collecting scale samples. Here we're taking data of American shad and other fish that are um, going through the fish lift um, at this dam that leads up to Lake Moultrie, and it's, it's really important for the environment that these fish can, you know, go to the ocean to spawn and then come back to their natural habitat in the freshwater estuaries. It means so much. I think that really being around the wounded warriors and being with my classmates, it builds a strong sense of character in, in the community. And it, it builds that connection that, that we'll remember even as we get older and, you know, as we recognize service members. The event was a successful day of outreach with both the Wounded Warrior Project and Ashley Hall. The Charleston District is proud to aid the recovery of our nation's heroes and help grow the minds of our future leaders.